Welcome to The Vital Life Show. I'm Dr. Janine Bowering, and The Vital Life Show is all about getting healthy from the inside out. So please do click subscribe. Uh, the button will come up at the end of the video. And really important that you do that because we're always uploading new and important information as to how to get healthy yourself, doing it naturally with easy home remedies, things that you can do, add to your diet, change your diet, exercise, facial exercises. I mean, we go through them all. So be sure to subscribe to this channel so that you're privy to our newest and latest videos and information about your health. So today's topic is all about better absorbed calcium supplements. Now, a lot of people take calcium about three, four years ago in the news, there was this whole hoopla about the unsafety. So it wasn't safe to take calcium supplements. And these were all, of course, synthetic supplements. And calcium taken together with magnesium and then they were trying to, trying to compare with or without vitamin D3. Well, what the research showed was that taking, you know, above a certain amount of calcium was actually linked to heart attacks in women especially, and this was in postmenopausal women, which is, you know, for the most part, the most commonly um, prescribed group of people to take calcium supplements, of course, because of osteoporosis. So what is the big deal with calcium? Well, in my opinion, it's always important to take calcium and magnesium separately. Magnesium does help with the absorption of calcium, but they compete for absorption if they're taken at the same time. So ideally you supplement your magnesium in the morning separately from your calcium which you supplement at night. And I, I promised I'd talk about the best absorbed type of calcium, which is a fossilized coral calcium. Now, a lot of people have heard about the benefits of taking a coral calcium, but a fossilized coral calcium in a powder form contains just the right amount of an absorbable form of calcium that's easily digested and you don't have to worry about those negative side effects that we've heard about in the news. So magnesium stearate and magnesium stearate unfortunately is what they use in the encapsulation process to make the ingredients run quicker on the machinery but that messes up with absorption and again absorption is so important especially when we're talking about calcium because Calcium that's not well absorbed can cause the problems associated with the cardiovascular disease and heart attacks and strokes. So again, when you're taking calcium, it's got to be the right kind. It has to be absorbed. And that's why taking it separate magnesium in the morning, your whole food calcium at night for best absorption, your growth hormone is secreted while you're sleeping. And that's why I suggest that you take your calcium at night so that, you know, it's going into the bones where you need it the most. The great thing about the whole food calcium as well is that it is alkalinizing to the body. And of course we need an alkaline environment in order for calcium to go into the bones. Most of the sources of calcium out there, unfortunately, are not alkalinizing. They're acidic. And what does calcium do in an acid environment if the blood becomes too acidic? Calcium comes out of the bones to buffer the blood. We don't want that. We want an alkalinizing formula. So easy to take. You don't have to worry about that. Again, just one scoop. It comes with a little scoop. At, and you take that at bedtime in a bit of water juice. Some, some people actually like to take in a bit of tea. So if you are a tea drinker, you like to have your tea in the evening, then you can actually mix it in tea. And for people who don't take a lot of dairy products, this is a great alternative because it, it actually makes it look like, it doesn't change the taste, mind you, but makes it look like uh, a cup of tea that has some dairy in it. So it's great for athletes, great for the cardiovascular system. We all need absorbable calcium and of course for osteoporosis. So because it's a, such a highly absorbed form of calcium goes into those bones can dramatically improve the calcium structure in the bones and help to maintain healthy bones and teeth so again remember to subscribe to this channel and like us on facebook follow us on twitter at vitatree and remember your health is in your hands you have the ability to live a healthy life the vital life